Hi, Lucas Mark Moore with the Thoroughbred Daily News. Woodford Thoroughbreds is coming off a couple of big years. They bred the Grade 1 winners, Discreet Lover, and Midnight Bizu. The latter, of course, is an Eclipse Award finalist, and they're set for a big 2020 as the breeders of Independence Hall, one of the early favorites for the Kentucky Derby. We talked to the farm's Shannon Castagnola about the exciting times ahead. The biggest thing for Woodford is that we need to be self-sufficient, and the way that John Sykes, who owns the farm, um, sees that and, and plans that out is that we're going to be diversified, and that really comes from his business background. Diversification in the market is really important to us, so you'll see that we have about 40 mares that we're breeding. Those horses are all sale horses. The plan is to sell all of them at a yearling sale, but we also have our farm in Florida that has the training center. So. We purchase yearlings to sell as two-year-olds, which is a different market for us. So we're, all, we're selling and buying for the next sale. And the purpose of that is to use our facility. We've got to keep it going. So we, we need horses in there to go through and produce off of the farm. We have shares in Exaggerator and Outwork, some really young stallions who are coming up with first crop horses. And, and so there's a lot of potential there and a lot of excitement with that. If you're only trying to sell yearlings or mares, for example, you basically only have income twice a year. But with a farm that's our size and um, with what we're trying to do, you know, if, if you go to the two-year-old sales, then that's income coming in at the, in the spring. And it just keeps everything going for the farm. So we have 80 stalls at the training center and we have outside clients. We have a lot of race people that um, are, are sending horses to us. and. John Gleason does an absolutely fantastic job. He's such a horseman, and the horses are in such good care. And we've really invested, too, and that's part of our strategy. We've had a really exciting couple of years with the grade one win from Discreet Lover, then Midnight Bee Sue coming back and, and you know being nominated for an Eclipse Award for Champion Older Dirt Female. And then we have Independence Hall currently on the Derby Trail. So that, you know that's a lot of exciting um, opportunities for us. And Woodford's strategy moving forward is to continue to try to maintain those type of horses. Um, we're going to obviously be bringing horses to the sales grounds. We'd like to sell them well. That's our purpose. But really, our goal, our end strategy for Woodford is to have horses that are running on the track, that are those big time Saturday afternoon type horses. And we want sound horses, tough horses, good horses. And, and that's our, our goal. That's what we want to bring to the table.